NASCAR at Circuit of the Americas is back this weekend, and this year's event will have more driver appearances, more music, and more fan zone experiences. Tier Newbaum is live at the track with a preview. Good morning, Tara. Good morning to you, Amanda. We're excited for this NASCAR triple header. Scott, when people come out this weekend, what's going to be happening? The action really starts tomorrow. Oh, well, hey, we've got practice on track tomorrow here at Coda. We're going to have a huge Echo Park Automotive Grand Prix weekend, three races, uh, two on Saturday, one on Sunday, but so much more for the fans to see and do while they're here. We're going to have more music. We're going to have more driver appearances, but here in the fan area, we're going to have stuff like everything from axe throwing to plastic platform diving to a human cannonball, even graffiti art. And we have Andrew here with Color Cartel. He's a local muralist, and he's already at work this morning. So, Andrew, when people see you out here for NASCAR at Coda, what exactly are you going to be doing? We're going to be doing a, a really great uh, installation. It's going to be a reference to the 60s Tower of Power that GMC did, but we're going to do it with a bunch of wrecked uh, NASCARs. That'll be right here at the entrance on a 24-foot wall. And then on the grid right before the race on Sunday, we're going to do a 16-foot wall. I'm going to take a, a graffiti tag. I'm going to blow that way up. And uh, the goal with that one is to really focus um, on the piece itself and try and take what I love about graffiti, what I love about racing, and try and deliver that in like a really distilled graffiti tag to the whole audience. So it should be a, a really uh, exciting thing to look at. Absolutely. That sounds unreal. Something you have to see in person out here at NASCAR. At Definitely. Coda. How long does something like that take to build and paint and so create? We, it took, it took uh, days of planning and building. The structure itself is going to be really massive. To actually paint it, we're going to paint the one right here uh, in two four-hour sessions, four hours Saturday, four hours Sunday. The one on the track is literally going to happen all in about two hours right before the race. Okay, yeah, that was going to be my next question. What time do people need to be here to see you in action? This one will be all day. The one on the track is going to be happening from 11 to 2 p.m. from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Uh, on Sunday, race day. I love that. Okay, we'll let you keep working on right. this. That was a blank canvas about one minute ago and in Scott when people come out you know what's the best way for them to make the most of their entire weekend here the coolest thing is really just have to give yourself time to enjoy it all I mean it's so much more than just what's happening on the track the stuff that Andrew is doing is going to be cool fans are going to get to see something they've never seen before and experience fun like they've never had it's going to be a great NASCAR party more driver appearances, more music. Can you talk about both of those options and interactions for the weekend? Absolutely. We're going to have driver appearances here in the fan zone at the Echo Park display. Drivers like Tyler Reddick's going to be out here. Chris Busher is going to be out here, a Texas native. Um, and then on the track side for our pre-race show, we're going to have Austin, Austin uh, Sendrick, who is a road course specialist, last year's defending champion of the entire series, Kyle Larson. They're going to be making appearances pre-race leading into Midland, which is going to be an awesome pre-race concert. So, so much fun and entertainment from the fan zone to the track. Um, it's it's going to be a blast. It absolutely is. Not only is there going to be more music, more fan uh, activations, but there is going to be so much action happening on this road course. The next gen car is taking uh, the Circuit of the Americas track for the first time ever. So uh, you can find more information and get those tickets at NASCAR at Coda dot com. And uh, how talented is Andrew here? This is just beautiful already. He showed up and created this in about two minutes. I can only imagine what he would do with more time. It's just a pretty incredible what's going to be out there. Congratulations, Tender. All right, TR, check with you a little later. We will be right back.